Cincinnati Bengals signed Zach Moss to a two-year, $8 million deal and cut loose Joe Mixon. So I thought Joe Mixon last season was solid once again for the Cincinnati Bengals. But Zach Moss definitely played a good role with the Indianapolis Colts until Jonathan Taylor came back to Zach Moss last season. 183 carries, 794 rush yards, five touchdowns, 27 catches, 192 receiving yards, and two receiving touchdowns. And now, obviously, there's a clear path for Zach Moss to be the starter over there for the Cincinnati Bengals with Joe Mixon coming off the books and getting cut loose. And Joe Mixon had a very good career with the Cincinnati Bengals. I think Mixon either went with the Baltimore Ravens, Dallas Cowboys, or even the Vegas Raiders, teams that need running backs after we've seen a flurry of running backs change teams here on free agency to start. So in terms of fantasy football, now with being the starter, third to the fifth round range, I think Zach Morse will go where he could be a solid number two running back for fantasy owners. Like I said, last season, we saw some explosive games out of him early in the year where he had 18 or more fantasy points in four out of five games to start the season. And then obviously he tailed off a little bit and Jonathan Taylor came back after he was injured and looking for a new contract. So Zach Morse signs with the Cincinnati Bengals and we'll see if he can have another successful season. And now that he's going to be the man over there in Cincinnati entering the 2024 season.